guys welcome back to my channel this is lifeline with comfort it is a program designed to equip empower inspire and motivate you to awaken the giant uh, within you before we continue i'd like to just say quickly um that you like comment subscribe and turn on the notification bell so that you get updated on every video i upload by the way i do that every week so get your friends share and let them know that uh, something is up it's coming right on your screen wherever you are in the world now i will just move straight to my topic today i'm talking about judging others judging others there's a story i heard that inspired me so much there was this young man that was on a train trip with his father um a very long trip i'm not, not too sure um how long the trip was but it was on a trip with his dad and i think he was about 16 to 17 years of age and on that trip at every point um uh, another train passes he'll scream with so much excitement oh daddy that should be a train that is a train right and daddy you say yes and you know he kept making notes of everything he saw the trees that passed um the 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 everything that passed he just kept making notes of it and there were two older couples sitting close to them and those couple uh, were looking a bit irritated and like why would a 16 17 year old boy be screaming at a, a, another train just passing by and they were a bit irritated and at some point they vocalized their irritation they looked at the dad and said why are you talking or celebrating what this young boy i mean he's old enough to know that that's just a train he's old enough to know that that's just a tree he should know this and the father smiled and looked at them and said well my son is 17 today and today is his first time of ever using his eyes to see we're just coming from a surgery that was successful he's been blind for 17 years so please don't feel angry don't feel um offended that he's excited that he can see for the first time what did this couple do wrong they actually judged him not realizing that he had not seen for 17 years while we would listen to this story and say what kind of couple is this this is how most of us behave at times when someone is happy when someone is celebrating you don't know that that might have been the best thing that's happened to them you don't know where they're coming from you don't know their story so you don't understand the glory or the testimony or why they're celebrating the bible says something in the book of matthew, um, matthew i beg your pardon chapter 7 judge not that you will not be judged it's so easy to point a finger at people and judge instead of celebrating them i did a video a couple of weeks ago the link will be um below and i just wanted to click and watch but it's about celebrating others celebrate when people are celebrating why is it easier for people to mourn when people are mourning come around someone if he's having an issue and you're all, all, all around saying i'm sorry sorry for what's happening and when it's time to celebrate with them it's so difficult can we make the world better by not judging others if you don't know their story then you don't know why they're celebrating when you meet people when you see them just celebrate to them thank god for them don't judge people don't judge people i'm not saying this just to you i used to oh my god used to judge i still do judge but i'm hoping that i'll be a better person i hope that this video has inspired you it's a short one but i'll like you like i said to subscribe uh, turn on the notification notification bell Blah. turn on the notification bell and i hope you have a great time i'll be back next week god bless you mightily in jesus name amen